Hi everyone, uh, my name is Tom Davies and I graduated from Crookwell High School in 2009. God, that is terrifying, I'm so old. Um, I was vice captain at the time, um, still bitter about that. Um, but I think I might still be the current PCYC 100 meter record holder, um, courtesy of a very windy day at Togkill Park. So if someone would check that for me, that would be great. Hey guys, my name's Brett Reynolds. I graduated from Crookle High in 2002. Hello, I'm Justin Gay and I graduated Crookle High in 2002. G'day everyone, my name's Alex Mironov. I'm a design director at uh, Deloitte Digital. I'm also a Crookle High School alumni class of 2001. My fondest memory of school was uh, playing with all my mates at lunch times and uh, morning teas. There was a lot of handball and uh, soccer played in those days. Hey, my name is Zachary McGregor. I graduated from Kuru High School in 2020. I'm about to go into my third year of studying at the University of Wollongong. Uh, I'm coming to you live from London, where I live, where I've been living for the last five years. I work uh, for a tech company here as the VP of Marketing. Uh, I've been working in for a lot of different tech companies and sort of around the world for the last 10 years. I left Crookle High and went to America. I played soccer at uh, college in Kentucky and in California, lived in San Francisco and New York. Um, so yeah, it's been a pretty exciting ride for the last 10 years. Over the past 20 years since graduating Crookle High, I started in the real estate game, purchasing my first business in 2005 and now running Ray White Golden, which is a family operated business it's operated in Goulburn since 1987 and we employ over 20 staff. Through that time, I've travelled to over 50 countries and um, grown through the years. I'm a dad, a husband and uh, an avid farmer on the weekends. Uh, when I first left school, I was a bit undecided what I wanted to do with life, so I worked on a property for about six months. Uh, before starting my carpentry apprenticeship with a local builder there in Crookle. I now find myself over in Canberra uh, with my beautiful wife and three kids and I run my own um, building and carpentry company. Living a busy lifestyle can sometimes be taxing but I've found having a great mentor and a loving family and spending great time, quality time with both and all is the secret to success. So I encourage you all to have conversations or find a mentor and take time to talk to your family and loved ones, particularly your friends. Always surround yourself with great people. That's the key. Cheers. The way that I look after myself is I try to stay active. Uh, in terms of what I do to keep uh, fit and healthy, I think mental health is really, really important. Um, and some of those mates that I grew up with are uh, part of my support base. So it's really important to surround yourself with people who support you for who you are and appreciate you for what you know for being you um, make sure that you do this and it'll set you up for success all the best see ya bye uh, having three young kids and a business to run life can get pretty stressful and i've found as far as my health goes personally uh, staying fit and active is a big one for me probably cutting those beers out after work lower them down a bit helps a lot and if i am struggling and my tip to you guys is just to reach out and have a chat with a mate or a colleague. You'll be surprised how many people are actually struggling and just need to have a chat. And that's about it from me, guys. So stay healthy and peace out. Um, what do I do to look after my health? I think there's a lot I've learned over the last 10 years. Um, and importantly, I think everyone will go through their own journey of working out what they need to be the best versions of themselves. I think. Probably one thing I've learned is it's really important that when you um, are exerting yourself through like work or social life or, or whatever it might be, is um, make sure you give yourself time to you know fill your cup up. Um, physical rest and mental rest are very different, I've learned, and just sort of lounging around doesn't necessarily help your brain sort of like reset. And so work out what it is for you that helps you to um, get back to a state where you can be the best version of yourself. That might mean, you know, maybe it is playing video games or maybe it's meeting friends for coffee or something, or maybe it's 
just regularly doing your routine and, and getting lots of rest. Uh, you work this stuff out as you as you get older, but I would say uh, be kind to yourself. It is, uh, you know, it's a can can be a tough time sort of working out, you know, what it is that um, helps you operate at your best. But I'm sure you'll all get there. And uh, say hi to everyone in Cripple for me, and all the best.